you want to work even faster, then you can set up and work with hotkeys inside of Snagit. So I have the Snagit recorder opened up right here. And here you can see that there's capture. So you can simply add in a hotkey right here. So let's say I'm go just going to press Shift plus R. And what happens is that that is a hotkey has been added in. So once I do that, I can simply go around here, just like that, press Shift and R. And what happens is that the crosshair appears just like that. So I can go around and capture uh, an image right over here, just like that. I can also go around over here onto file and I can go on to capture preferences right here and capture preferences. If I were to go to hotkeys, you can see all of the hotkeys right here. So and uh, so and uh, hide snag it is control plus shift plus X. I can also enable alt if this one is preserved for some other application. You can also repeat the last capture right over here by pressing control and A, let's say, for example, and then video capture start is shift and F9. You can change this out into any other key that you want and shift and control shift and alt can be added as well. And of course, like even uh, uh, you don't want, uh, let's say, for example, any of the new settings, you can just restore the default and you can allow Snagit to override any other hotkey assignments uh, that might happen there for other applications as well. So this is how you can work around uh, with hotkeys to make your work process faster in Snagit. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.